I've been curious my whole life and I've owned many different businesses. I've been in business for myself most of my life. And when I saw the freight farm, I said, there's another business I can go into. I did name it Vet Veggies. I chose that name for one reason. We have five generations of combat veterans in my family, going back to the Civil War. And as a veteran of the Vietnam era, I know how hard it can be to transition from an active outdoor life back to a, a life in a cubicle somewhere. And a lot of veterans, uh, I don't think, are interested in cubicles. So I thought if I could create a brand which I could share with any veteran across the United States at no charge, uh, the brand of Vet Veggies, grown by a local veteran. That would be an entree for anyone anywhere into their local market. I mean, there's a lot to it. Um, you know, in the first few times, it's, it's just getting the process down and, and understanding how things work. Uh, it's not like a business that you buy that's already started, um, which I've had. This one was something that it's up to us. Um, to make it work. But you get in and you, you figure things out. You know, there's things you learn every week to make it better. My personal goal would be to, to be able to make a profit uh, and, and get more units. Um, to be able to not have to be tied to a nine to five job. Small business uh, requires a lot of attention to detail a lot of studying your market, of understanding the uh, metrics behind your business, statistics, who your customers are, where your money goes, and where your money comes from. Small business is a school that you go to and you don't ever graduate. You keep learning every day. You know, it's almost like getting a puppy each week. Uh, Puppies make you feel loved and you feel good about being able to give love back to them. They need you. That's kind of the way my lettuce is. I mean, when I plant those seeds on Sunday, I know that by Tuesday or Wednesday, they'll start to germinate. And of course, that's when I start to talk to them. Uh, they don't talk back for a while, but it, you, you bring something to life and that's always, uh, such a fascinating event for me to bring something to life and see it grow and mature. And uh, when I plant the seeds, I have hope that the future is going to be good.